Meantime, Illinois high school students are taking cautious steps to get back to the gridiron. The Illinois High School Association is moving ahead with, with plans to get players back on the field, but they will face some new restrictions. WGN's Mike Lowe live in Evanston this afternoon with the story. Mike. Ben and Lourdes, good afternoon to both of you. The Illinois Department of Public Health reportedly approved these guidelines within the last couple of days, and that means that up to 50 coaches and players can now gather for conditioning, practicing, even games if social distancing is maintained. Anything that you're planning during COVID times requires 10 times the amount of preparation. So we've spent uh, countless hours the past few weeks um, preparing for uh, the ability to run camps for about 25 different sports. Evanston Township High School Athletic Director Chris Livettino says getting ready for high school summer camps to start again required a lot of work with the goal of making sports safe. It's a great opportunity to, to do this in a safe, uh, in a safe manner. Um, but just to have our coaches be able to reconnect with their kids again, just to see them face to face instead of separated by, you know, a, a TV screen or a computer screen uh, is going to do a lot for their hearts. I Elsewhere on the North Shore, signs at Loyola Academy read, Welcome back students and staff. Be safe. Student athletes were greeted by a check-in table with hand sanitizer, masks and wipes, and a symptoms checklist. We are checking everyone's temperature upon arrival of the school. They do not enter a field or an indoor space without getting their temperature checked. The Loyola football team, a perennial state title contender, moved the school's weight room outside. This is the outdoor weight room. We had to move the entire weight room outside uh, due to the pandemic. After lifting weights, the players made sure to wipe down the barbells and dumbbells. It all has to be done while maintaining social distance. The team has been broken up into small groups with several sessions throughout the day. Trying to have as much space and air uh, so that it'll keep the campers safe. Um, and we're just really excited to be back out. So. At high schools across the state, all sports except for volleyball, basketball, swimming and water polo will be held outside. With Illinois trending in the right direction, there's hope the entire fall sports season will be played. And during this 20 day period for camp, which the IHSA is calling contact days, coaches are required to wear masks throughout the entire session. As for fans, if games are actually played, they will be limited to 20% capacity so that they can spread out in the stands. Reporting live outside of Evanston Township High School in Evanston, Mike Lowe, WGN News. Okay, Mike, thank you.